Man, I'll never forget when side imaging came out. When, when Humminbird introduced side imaging, all of a sudden it opened a whole new world. We were able to look at shorelines. We were able to see boulders in there. We were able to see turns, what underwater points really looked like. I mean, it was just the neatest thing in the world as far as I was concerned. And I think a lot of people looked at it that way, that it was a great tool for bass fishing. But let me tell you, over the years, this stuff has come so far, the technology has come so far that you look at this Humminbird Helix that I'm running today. I use my side imaging out in deep water to find walleyes and walleye structure every single day. And let me tell you how I do it and what I'm looking for. Number one thing I do is I try to use that Lake Master map to give me an idea of where I might have that bottom content change because that's what I'm looking for here. I'm looking for scattered rock. I'm looking for boulders. I'm looking for things that are probably going to just add to a spot. Well, I'm going to get tipped off to some of that by that Lake Master map because it's going to show me some of those points and some of this and that. So I know where to start looking. But then I can go along with my side imaging and I can actually look in and I can say look it there's a whole bunch of little boulders in there some little gravel rock there's differences there than there is on this side of the boat over here I might see a soft bottom and I know that there's probably not gonna be as many fish there because when it comes down to it walleyes want everything they can get in a piece of structure if they can have rubble if they can have extra scattered rock weeds whatever it may be that's gonna attract them and it's gonna hold them and that's what I can find with this side imaging unit so here's what I would tell you when you're looking at your hummingbird units and you're trying to decide which one to buy, I think down imaging is enormously important for walleye fishing, but equally important if you want to find those spots on the spot, the one where you're sitting right here and 50 yards away they can't catch fish but you're killing them, you want to get side imaging too because it's going to allow you to look in and see things without having to drive over it and you can see stuff on deep structure just as well as you can shallow structure. So make sure that when you're looking at these units, you include a side imaging piece in that unit. You want to buy the side imaging piece because you're going to use it. You're going to use it day in and day out. You're going to catch fish because of it.